at the Royal Commission Yambu Colleges and Institutes or RCYCI in Saudi Arabia. We provide hands-on laboratory experience to our students so that they are job ready on completion of their academic degree. The process control lab and the electrical, electronics and instrumentation engineering technology and, uh, department one, is one such facility that brings a sense of reality to the learning environment. It uses virtualization technology to efficiently and rapidly update, develop, maintain and restore the distributed control system or the DCS in the industry. Uh, more details in application, same as in com uh, petrochemical company and uh, refineries like Aramco and Sabic. So if you study in Yambo Industrial College, you feel like in a petrochemical company or refineries. The Real Commission College graduates, uh, including Yambo and Jubail, are one of our best intakes. Uh, they have high quality and uh, in terms of discipline, and they are willing to, to learn. And actually when they are employees, they are they are producing the best quality. The Delta V controller from Immersion Process Management is a real industrial solution used in process industries such as petrochemical, water treatment and paper making. This system consists of a series of process control training rigs which are all controlled by an Immersion Delta V controller. These include the temperature control rig the forced air cooler to provide a thermal load, a level and flow process element, and a pressure process element. The DCS comes complete with a personal computer, software, a controller, and the input-output modules needed to monitor and control the process rigs. The Delta V software is provided with mimic diagrams to show the status of each rig as if it were showing actual industry conditions. They also allow the monitoring and adjustment of system parameters. A user can scroll through the mimic screens to get an overview of the system status. It can be used to reduce the level of a fluid in a tank when needed. The user can see that a servo valve closes the flow rate drops and the level in the tank falls. Similarly, the student can control the temperature of a liquid with the help of heat exchanger. In response, the valve opens and the forced air cooler fan increases in speed. On the mimic diagram, the student sees these changes happening and can observe the results and changes in temperature. Most of the industrial steam systems have a pressure control system. High pressure steam is reduced to lower pressure for a process or heating application. Now suppose there is a large process plant. Should a pump fail in one part of the plant, a valve in another sector may need to close to prevent the release of harmful emissions into the environment. Here our student is simulating a pump failure. Immediately the flow drops to zero and the tank starts to empty. The alarm sounds to signify a fall condition and the valve and the pressure system closes to prevent disaster. Alarms can then be acknowledged and cancelled by the operator. The DCS trainer is helping our students understand how to control the entire distribution process, right from the basics of field components in the process industry to the final control algorithms that are used in various applications. Join the Royal Commission Yambu Colleges and Institutes where there is a strong focus on active learning and the practical aspects of education.